September 7th, 1997. Role-playing games as we know will be forever changed with the release of Final Fantasy VII on the PlayStation 1. That was over 20 years ago, and we finally have a remake. What's happening, y'all? It's Fire Dog, and I am just so excited for this. Uh, I, I've waited a very, very long time to finally get this. Uh, this is the uh, Soldier First Class Edition of the Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, here to be unboxed. It just arrived, and uh, I, I couldn't be more excited. Uh, I've really been looking forward to this. It's been sitting, uh, staring at me, taunting me all day, and I've finally just now been able to get around to opening it. Uh, so let's crack this thing open. Of course, we got to use the uh, honorary Buster Sword to crack into it here. Let's see what we get. Man, I'm so excited I'm shaking. This is going to be so cool. All right. Oh, it's a box in a box. Isn't that how it usually goes? Yeah. So, with this edition, I actually am not entirely sure what all we get. I made it a point not to look uh, at everything. Uh, I know we get a player's kind of figure and uh, a couple other goodies, but uh, let's see what we get here. Our first box, our second box, and just some paper. So we'll leave that over there. And now we'll come into the first box here. It's awkward, but it works. <laughs> All right. All right. Ooh, this is nice. So they've really foamed it up here so it doesn't get damaged. Uh, the Play Arts Kai figures are the uh, official figures from the Square Enix store and I did order this from the Square Enix store so now we know that it's uh, legitimate because there are a lot of fakes out there. Here's a nice little packaging we get here. Final Fantasy 7 Play Arts Kai and it says Cloud Strife and Hardy Daytona which is the uh, motorcycle that he uses to escape from Midgar. Uh, so maybe the gameplay footage uh, I don't know yet. I've made it a point not to see very many spoilers but uh, we might actually get to see that in full HD. So we'll I'm gonna gently crack into this here. And this open here. Ooh. Oh, it's got to be assembled. Oh, okay, that's just a stand. Oh, man. Here we go. Slide it out here. And there we have it. Holy cow, that is gorgeous. That is awesome. That is incredible. That thing is huge. Alright, so here we have the cloud figure. Nice and he's looking uh, very soldiery. And then here we have the Party Daytona. Oh, there's a sword and his stands and stuff there, along with several figures. We'll take those out later. And here's the Party Daytona. Oh, that is so cool! Oh man, the wheels move. Oh, 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 oh look at that! Oh, that thing is awesome. That is just way too cool. I feel bad for even opening it, man. Oh, oh, the wheels not only turn. But the back uh, pivots back and forth. Does the front? It does. That is just way too freaking cool. And I've got a spot just for that. And then you have his weapons and stand and different things like that. Uh, whew, wow, that is that's 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 an impressive figure. I like that. So we'll crack into this here. This is probably the game and. 
other accoutrements. Uh -oh. Alright. So, yep, we have our Square Enix store lanyard. Nice little uh, lanyard there for holding your keys on or displaying with your figures. It's got uh, Aerith uh, and Tifa on one side and then Cloud and Barrett on the other. So very cool there. And then we have the Super Deluxe Edition with the nice embossing. I like that it's uh, it's raised there. Uh, some some uh, you know some great detailing. And then on the back, it's got some cool holographics. It's got Sephiroth looking menacing, and Cloud and Aerith, and Barrett and Tifa, and then all the the nice little uh, DLC that it comes with. So. It's got Sephiroth looking menacing, as usual. Uh, he's got his mass immune, uh, some beautiful art of Midgar in the background there. And then let's see if there's anything inside. And then it's got uh, what was the original art now updated with uh, Cloud in front of the uh, Shinra Mako reactor. So very cool there. So thank you so much for joining me. I am just too excited right now. I'm going to go install it and get it all, get it all installed and updated and uh, get ready to start playing it. Um, I'll release a video of my first impressions of what I thought so far. Uh, so stay tuned with that. Uh, as well as um, I'll, I'll start streaming it on Twitch again. So if you, uh, you know, if you have Twitch, you want to hop on there, uh, hop on and say hi. Thanks so much for joining me. Have an awesome day. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe and stay out of trouble.